Hello guys, this is Saurav. In this video, I'm going to show you how to create online course website without any theme purchase. And it's totally free, free and free. So you don't need to pay any amount to anyone. We are going to use here one plugin and that's it. And that plugin is also free of cost. So let's see, I'm going to show you this step by step and we are going to create online course website. So now you can see here that's my default website, right, uh, WordPress. So now I'm going to the dashboard and here we, we are going to add one theme that's free and uh, we are going to type here some educational, we have to add some educational website to make a course website. So you can see here education consultant. So I'm going to preview this website and uh, it is for display. Okay. And that's you can see that's that's better. Okay. No problem with that. So install this website. Sorry theme. And now you can see you need to click on activate button. So wait some seconds and you can see that's activate button. Click on it. Now we are going to see our website here. So refresh this and now you can see that's website there is nothing now we are going to create the course website right so here we have to add some courses so we need to add one plugin that is free of cost you don't need to pay anything for that so click on plugin and here you will see add new option add plugin so you have to search here learn press that's the plugin name right so wait some seconds to search this plugin now you can see here learn press wordpress lms plugin so you need to install this app install now and wait some seconds to install it after this you have to activate this oh, okay now click on activate right so here we are going to create one course right so there is very simple option to create a course and uh, first we need to set up this plugin so after activate this plugin you will see this window and we have to set up this so here you can see a run setup wizard so click on this and currency if you are from us we have to choose us and if you're from anywhere we have to choose your currency right and uh, currency position left thousand separator decimal operator number of decimal okay and now continue A static page course uh, course something in home right profile nothing and we are just going to click on continue and enable so we are not going uh, if you want to enable so you have to click on enable and you have to put your email id where which one is your paypal account so i'm going to put my email id here for 24 at the rate gmail.com that's my paypal email id and click on continue you don't need to anything and now again continue email system we are no we are not going to sign any email right now and install a sample course so here you will see the options create new course visit your site or back to dashboard so here we are going to what we do uh, install sample course so if I'm going to this so click on install sample course this will install the demo course so right click on view now you will see here that's my sample course so that's my home page of my website and you can see here home sample course you will see overview circulum instructor so that's overview uh, if i'm going to create the html course so i have to put uh, and i have to write something about html here so i'm going to write here replace this text to my html content and you can see here enroll button so now that's very simple so now i'm going to add uh, the another course from the dashboard so this will explain you more better right so i'm going to dashboard and you can cut this right so here's my website you can see there is nothing right now and if i'm going to refresh it you will see one course that we recently 
upload okay there is nothing Let's click on home right so go to dashboard now we are going to here you can see there is learn press and here is a lot of option here so we are going to add one course here so we need to click on courses right and you will see here is one already sample courses there right so i'm going to add one another course so you need to click on add new right and uh, here you will see uh, option of your course name so i'm going to use a html so my course is all about html and uh, I'm, I'm gonna search about html in google and just copy and paste some content you're not going to copy and paste from another site right so you have to put your own content in your course right in your website i'm just it's just a demo right so now you can see there's a lot of option here so i'm going to use here the like you can see write section name and press enter so i'm going to add introduction so introduction and enter and that's the introduction i'm going to use here create a new lesson right so describe about this section so i'm going to copy and paste something and select item there's nothing right now and you have to click on again like uh, that one is your introduction right and uh, create new lesson so i'm going to use here another one let's create another thing like another thing simple and now we are going to save it so you will see here a course setting option also uh, duration 10 okay assignment pricing so here is the thing right now i'm going to request hundred dollar and uh, review log the thing and author is sorrow right so i love comment it's okay and you need to click on your publish button i'm going to click on publish right that's that's very easy right so you will see the option here is a link uh, courses and html so uh, i'm going to put some create some one page here and uh, create one link you can see uh, so i'm going to use here go to the appearance and open menu option and here you will need to create one custom or uh, custom course or here you can see there is an option lot of option so here you will see courses html courses so add new to menu if you want to add your course in your menu so you can do this from here now right now i'm doing i'm not doing this right because if you have more than 50 courses then you cannot add every course in your menu option right so i'm going to use your custom link right so here you can see custom link option and i'm going to do this uh, here i'm going to paste this link copy this link and paste here and remove the html and redirect to courses so copy courses paste here your link text and courses and add to menu so that's your home and that's your courses right okay now i'm going to click on save menu and go to your website and refresh the website okay here you will see the option home and second one is courses and whenever i'm click on courses button and you will redirect to course page and you will see here is two courses sample course and html course actually uh, i'm not added here featured image so i have to add featured image right so here again that's our html course we have to add that feature image so i'm going to search about html and go to the images option and add some normal image like this one. Oh no it's so long actually so we have to add some similar kind of image so you have to resize image also save this image and go to your added course and you, here you can see set featured image so click on this and upload click on select file and go to the download folder open html image and set as a featured image right and click on update 
we have to do this for our sample courses also so go to this courses again and open your sample course edit it and you have to set featured image so i'm going to set demos and demo featured image here so i'm going to do this that one people's here college students and save this and update this right so this one is updated now go to the course and refresh your page now here you will see there is a problem with the images right uh, you can see there is uh, actually this one image is uh, here image is height uh, greater than greater than this image so there is a problem with this so you have to choose similar images and you can see like uh, and you have to choose very uh, like uh, same size image so i'm going to do uh, i'm going to do this with uh, remove this featured image or change in to this image set update it and go to the course and refresh this now you can see they both are images are same size so it's look nice right so you can add multiple courses here now that one is free and buy this course so there is option so whenever people click on buy this course okay there is a problem with uh, css here you can see whenever go to the button so you have to edit the css uh, go to the customize option i'm going to edit this right now okay and uh, this is the our property so double click, uh, right click inspect element and uh, select this and go to here and here you can see there is our option what's going on hover effect our effect okay here is background color okay whenever we click on our so it will going to clear. okay so what uh, what i am to do here uh, put in how so it's too uh, too much coding so i'm not going to add everything so copy and paste this i'm going to do this for my all website additional css and paste this and i have to choose some color like i'm going to use here white and uh, it's not working or I have to do okay I have to remove this and okay color spelling is mismatch it's still not working important yeah now working click on publish and cut this and cut it now whenever we click uh, uh, go to the this so that's not a problem right on this enroll sample course and this will redirect me to sample course right that's fine there's something maybe problem so try to add some sample courses first okay here's featured image and you can see item complete and course complete and you can see overview here that's your overview continue right so that's the lesson one lesson 2 lesson 3 uh, there are a lot of courses right so that's very simple process to make a course website so i'm going to add it this sample course right so what we will do go to the courses option and uh, you can uh, duplicate this now you have to add one plugin that's name is duplicate page or duplicate post so you will see this option here after installing that plugin okay that's name is duplicate package or duplicate post and I'm, I have just copied this and make it like it's Java and publish this course right so now you can see that's my sample course right and you have to describe some here something and I'm going to add it my sample course right I'm not going to do this um, this one so you have to edit this right here you can see there is a section one section 
1 to 11 and I'm going to click on section 1 and if you want to add it something in section 1 or section 1 name or you want to chapter chapter 1 so we can do whatever we want to write and that's fine and if you want to add it the this uh, like this lesson 1 target or lesson 1 uh, uh, lesson 1 content so you have to add it here wait a second You can see here edit item, edit lesson, chapter 1 and you have to edit your chapter 1 here. You have to edit everything whatever you want to edit here. You can edit whatever you want to put uh, some HTML content or something. So you can do this. So that's very easy uh, to use this plugin, right? So I have published this, updated this, yeah, I have updated now go to the course again and uh, i'm going to open this in cognitive to see it properly okay and you will see traveler.com courses no i'm not going to direct course if someone open your website like travelerplan.club now you can see here the home you can design your home according to your requirement and whenever click on courses so you will see there's an option of three codes. So, uh, so that's all about it. So if you have any doubt, you can ask me and comment. Okay. And that's a very simple way to create an online course website. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you have any doubt, you can ask me and comment. And please like my video, subscribe my channel and don't forget to share. Thank you so much.